Hello guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel Video Solver. Today we are going to discuss some important questions of graph theory BACS 405B. From module 1, there are important questions. First question is consider the following graph G. The given graph which is G. And the sub question is what type of graph is G? And the second sub question is find the pendant vertex in G. And the third sub question is how many components are there in G? And the fourth sub question is find the minimum degree of g in g and the fifth question is find the average degree dg of the graph g draw the two vertex disjoint subgraph of g and the second question is show that the number of vertices of odd degree in a graph is always even and the third question is show that the maximum number of edges in a simple graph with n vertices is n into n minus 1 by 2 and the fourth question is distinguish between complete graph and complete bipartite graph and the fifth question is verify whether the following graphs are isomorphic or not the graph is given g1 and g2 and the next sixth question sixth question is determine whether the following graphs are isomorphic or not the last question is explain the five applications of graphs next module first question is by specifying the walk draw the two euler graph and un unitrus graph and the second question is if all the vertices in a Connected graph G are of even degree, then show that G is Eulerian. And the third question is define Hamiltonian cycle. How many edge disjoint Hamiltonian cycle exist in a complete graph with five vertices? Draw the graph to show the specific the specify the cycle. The fourth question is show that the connected graph G has a Eulerian trial if and only if there are exactly two vertices of odd degree in g next fifth question there are two sub questions are there prove that in any di any diagraph the sum of the in degrees of all vertices is equal to the sum of the out degrees and this sum is equal to the number of edges in a diagraph the second sub question is draw a complete symmetric diagraph and complete asymmetric diagraph with four vertices the last question is define diagraph find the in degree and out degree of the following graph the figure is given below the next module third module and that first question is define a tree prove that prove that in a graph g there is one and only path between every pair vertices g is a tree the second question is explain the following cut edge cut vertex cut set and the third question is define vertex connectivity and edge connectivity give the relation between them and the fourth question is prove that every circuit has even number of edges in common with a cut set the fifth question is define fundamental circuit if g is a graph with 10 vertices and q edges then find the number of fundamental circuit in a graph and the sixth question is show that every connected graph contain a spanning tree and the second sub question is find the number of tree branches and chord in the following graph with seven vertices and 14 edges the graph is given below and the next module fourth module and that first question is state and through Euler's forma formal that gives the number of regions in a planar graph. And the second question is describe the steps of find adjac adjacency matrix and incidence matrix for the directed graph with a simple example. The third question is draw the geometric dual of the following graph. And the fourth question is give two conditions for the testing planetary of a given graph. Sketch a simple graph for planar graph and non planar graph. The fifth question is defined by the following. First is planar graph, second is embedding, third is non planar, fourth is cartowise two graph. The sixth question is write a note on path matrix. And the last module, fifth module. First question is define chromatic number through that graph with a least one edges is true chromatic if and only if has no circuit of odd length. And the second question is state and prove four color theorem. And the third question is state and prove five color theorem. And the fourth question is write a note on greedy coloring algorithm. And the fifth question is define matching and complete matching. Obtain two complete matching from the given graph. And the last question is prove that an n minus vertex graph is a tree if and only if its chromatic polynomial is Pn into lambda is equal to lambda of lambda minus 1 power n minus 1 here is the important questions thank you for watching our video do like share and subscribe